Hello friends, it's Prajil Patel this side and watching my YouTube channel. Friends, this is the seventh tutorial in the series File Handling with Python. So, in the last tutorial, we learned how to compress and decompress files and folders using Python, zip file, and certain modules. Moving further, in this video, we are going to learn how can we create temporary files using Python. Now, what is a temporary file? Temporary file is uh, basically the type of file uh, which can store your temporary data while your program is running. After uh, the, temp uh, the job of your temporary file is done, uh, the, these are just stored in the temp folder of the Windows, which means they will be automatically get deleted after a certain amount of time. Okay, uh, so these are quite handy when you are making some applications and you, not, and you do not want to store your data permanently. Sometimes uh, they have to store your data for a temporary amount of time. Okay, so let's see how can you create temporary files using in python so to create a temporary file python provides a module called temp file this helps us to create temporary files and once your program is done uh, python automatically deletes the temporary file that you have created okay so let's see how can you we use this module so from temp file uh, this is your module name we are just going to import a, a class that is temp file okay so let's just import it and the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm just going to create an object of this class. So let's say temporary file. We are just going to create a tp variable. Okay. Uh, now then our class name. Uh, it takes two things. First, uh, the mode in which you want to open the file. Uh, that can be read, write, append, uh, read plus, write plus, append plus and rt wt at uh, r plus t w plus t uh, all these things are modes in which you can open the temporary files uh, we have already learned about uh, uh, modes in the previous tutorial of the zip file and the first tutorial of the series in the text files so here the mode that i'm just going to use is the r plus t which means i'm going to open the temporary file in read and write but the text file the file that will be created is a text file uh, there's one more thing r plus b which stores the data in a binary file but we want it in open it in uh, we want to save it in a text file okay so let's see uh, just pass r plus t and yep, we are good to go now uh, the next thing that i'm going to do is i'm just going to uh, do this trim uh, tp dot write uh, you can write anything inside this any string thing that you want to write so here i'm just going to write hello world now as i have opened it in, uh, the file in read mode i can either write to it or i can read the data that is written in the file too so to read the data first we have to go to the beginning of the file how to go to the initial cursor or the initial position or the beginning of the file yeah, we have a method called seek mm -hmm. it's also in the text file so we have to use fp.seek sorry it will be tp.seek not fp.seek tp.seek is zero zero is the position where we want to go uh, 0 means the beginning of the file and then I'm going to do this I will be creating variable data which will store uh, the content that is written in the file what is the content is written or uh, written file this is the content that we have just used okay now uh, suppose if I just close the file uh, wait a minute uh, let me just do this uh, since we have created a file we have to also close it so tp.close then and here i'm just going to use this print data see here the folder i'm currently working is this temp files now if i run this program you will see no text file will be created but a temporary file will be created hello world uh, in which the data will be written hello world then this data will be read and print on the screen so let me just run this program and show you see hello world is uh, being printed on the screen but no file is being created here okay the next thing is uh, the windows stores the temporary file in a special folder called temp to open the folder you have to press the win key plus r key okay win r so inside that you have to type percent temp percent okay and if you press okay it will it will open the folder where the temporary files are created so this is the folder where temporary files are created but here too no file is created why because whenever you uh, uh, use the close method python will automatically delete the file that we have just created so if you do not want to delete your file what you can do here there's a, 
uh, parameter that we can pass delete uh, equals false and if we pass this the file that will be that just created will not be deleted okay so see here uh, this is the file that we have just created tmpf ct uh, blah blah uh, see temporary file automatically gives the name uh, which stands for tmp which means temporary file this is the file that we have just created and it automatically went to the temp folder okay because temporary files are stored in this particular folder uh, if you remove this parameter the file will be automatically deleted uh, by python so this is how you can uh, create temporary files write some data in it and then uh, use it throughout the program but remember if you just close the file that you created uh, the file will be automatically deleted except if you pass this particular parameter okay? so yeah this is it for this video guys i hope you learned something new if you are into my uh, people of this video leave a like or dislike if you are into my channel subscribe it thank you see you in the next video